guys welcome back to the vlog we're in london again i'm gonna be here for two days so this time i'm in london alone so this is going to be like a solo travel vlog but it was not able to come with me which i am quite sad like i'm not the biggest fan of traveling alone i've done it i just prefer traveling with someone but since i'm vlogging i'm gonna be talking to you guys i'm staying at the Ketners in soho i landed like an hour ago i just got to the hotel and i ordered room service i also didn't bring my camera so everything that you're gonna see on this vlog is gonna be filmed with a new iPhone because I end up being able to upgrade my phone. If you watch my last vlog, it's set until November, but I went to make the line at the Apple store the launch date and I was able to get one, so I decided to not pack my camera. I also feel more comfortable vlogging on the street with the phone, so let's see how the quality of the phone is. It's a 15 Pro Max in titanium. The plan for today is after eating, I went to rest a little bit because honestly, it's quite a hassle to get from the airport to the hotel and also like the entire flight. And I'm gonna see a friend for dinner. I'm gonna go to Selfridge and I think we're gonna have dinner either there or around there so we're gonna do that and tomorrow morning I have no idea what I'm gonna do I mean I guess it's kind of one of the perks of traveling alone then you can do whatever you want so maybe we're gonna go to a musical maybe I'm gonna go book shopping or shopping we're definitely gonna do a little bit of shopping I'm gonna go get some coats since we started fall I mean I'm filming this video end of September you're gonna probably see this around mid-October I want to go buy some jackets and coats to El Gupi so tomorrow we're gonna do that they do have a boutique here i'm waiting for the room service but in the meantime i'm gonna show you the room probably outfit of the day um the bags that i brought etc so as i said i got a bigger room this time it's actually quite massive the bed is not perfect because i was clearly already laying down there but the room is stunning Something that I love about Soho houses, it's the wallpapers, like the details are so beautiful. There's the vanity and the mini bar. Of course, I brought the Birkin 35, my black classic flap and my mini kitty. And I also wanted to show you the bathroom because it's insane. It's so big. So this is it. I think you can control the light here. Okay, yeah, you can. So it's a little bit better like this. It has this massive bathtub right here, toilet shower and this is a view from the hotel i'm starving so i hope that the food arrives soon and after that i guess maybe we can go for a walk or go read at the park the weather is actually really nice and um yeah let's see room service is here so we're gonna eat and i found a tv show about buying and selling houses so as always come for tv okay so we're gonna go to selfridge now this is going to be the test of fire for the ballerinas because i'm gonna walk a lot today with them so let's see how i like them back of the day is the mini kelly the jacket is from massimo Dutti, a very plain top this belt is from Blen. It's gonna be a while until you get to wear it though. It's really cute.
So I'm back at the hotel. I am so tired. We basically went to every single store at Selfridge. This time I was able to film. Last time, I don't know why, but a few guards, they were like just asking me not to film in general. I bought a pair of jeans. I'm really excited because I always have issues finding jeans. So I hope that the camera is good enough like at night. I am sure that camera is probably better for night filming than the iPhone, especially because I'm filming with the frontal camera, but I got a pair of jeans. I will not try them on right now, but maybe I'm gonna wear them tomorrow. I have the the hardest time finding jeans because I have like a smaller waist but my legs are thicker I don't like skinny jeans so I want baggy jeans but baggy jeans are usually like very very baggy on top and on the bottom but in the middle section they're not like they're actually super tight so I usually have to size up a lot and then I have to cinch them on the waist and shorten them and then I end up with very very heavy pants so um Stella showed me that in Selfridge there's this like jeans heaven basically and I got these ones from the Citizens of Humanity and they're called the, the Anina and they're super comfy, they feel like sweatpants almost so I will need to tailor them a little bit but I always have to shorten pants anyway so that was the only thing that I bought today I saw the Crystal Chanel sling bags they are amazing and they told me that if I go to I think it was Bond Street I may find them in my size I tried them on and they were like size 36 and a half and I'm 35 but they're so pricey so I don't think that I'm gonna do it walked all day with these ones I would recommend them I'm usually very picky with shoes these are comfy so I think now I'm gonna take a shower do my skincare routine and go to bed so i'm ready to go to bed i took my sleeping pills and hopefully i'll be able to fall asleep in a bit honestly i think it's a good thing that i'm like so tired i think i'm gonna read a little bit so yeah see you tomorrow Good morning. I actually slept quite well. The bed was very comfy. It's like nine. I decided to wake up a little bit later. Usually when I travel, I wake up like at seven, but I didn't feel like doing that this time. I am going to go have breakfast anywhere close to the hotel and maybe go book shopping. I want to try my luggage Chanel again for the sparkly shoes. And I think there's a Chanel boutique right next to El Copini boutique. I'm finishing getting ready and made the first cup of coffee. Okay, I'm gonna show you the outfit of the day. I'm wearing a basic black t-shirt, the Ahmus belt, and the pants are, I think, Aritzia, but I didn't tailor them, so they have pins on the bottom. And I'm gonna wear my El Cupini coat. This one is called the Coco Coat. So basically we're wearing a black and white fit, and this is the bag. Since I came alone, I am a little bit scared to use like top handle bags, especially in big cities like London. So I do feel like doing the back curls, but it kills the outfit a little bit, but I definitely feel safer carrying the bag like this. And if I take the subway or I don't know, I just crossbody it under the coat and I'm fine. I'm not gonna use the mini kill because I'm wearing black and I don't want to give it color transfer. And for jewelry, pearl earrings, I think the two clips go very well with this outfit. But yeah, I think you can see the pins there. I swore that I was gonna fix them before coming, but I didn't and I packed them anyway. So we're gonna have to live with that. Let's go for breakfast. There's a lot of traffic. I think I'm gonna take this subway to the boutique. Considering to maybe tomorrow go see Harry Potter and the Cursed Child, so maybe. So I'm walking 
to the store and uh, afterwards I think I'm gonna go to Chanel. The sun came out so no rain and walking around has been really nice actually. I am actually really excited to go to the store for the first time because I always just shop online and I can't wait to see their new collection. Like they have a few jackets and like shorter coats for fall. I'm also thinking about going to Paris soon so they would be really nice for Paris because it's not like full coat weather and I didn't bring most of my jackets when I moved. The shoes have been great. So this is what I'm gonna try on. You guys know this one, this is the Eloise. It's really nice. They have it back in stock because it was sold out for a while. This is the London and they have it in so many colors. This one I have it in white and I want to try it in black. There's also a few jackets and I found the Camila in black. So I'm gonna try that on too. hotel and I got a lot of stuff so I think we're in trouble but I'm gonna show you everything that I got this is so soft I wish that you could see but like it's amazing I'm gonna link everything of course I have this one in white already so I wanted to get the vlog version too this is so soft I love it this is gonna be great for traveling it's a scarf but it kind of doubles as a blanket and the quality is insane it's so so nice I also wanted it in navy but they didn't have my size so I got this one in camel and I also got it in white I'm gonna to wait and probably order to my house the navy one this is the only place where i can actually put the tripod i have to actually put my luggage and then on top the tripod and then my phone but i wanted to try on and show you everything that i got today i went looking actually for the leather jacket it's their new release and it's sold out so by the time that i'm posting this video if it's back in stock i would highly recommend you to snag it so these are the london jacket the small did fit me very well but again i really like the oversized look and they didn't have it in the medium so i got the camel and the white one because i love them i love the fit and they're so soft i if you like oversized look i would recommend you to go for the medium and if you like a little bit more tight fitting then i would go for small but this i love it i wish that they would do it in gray too and i'm gonna show you the white this one is gonna look so good even with the jeans that i got yesterday now this is the i believe mohair alpaca sweater so this is a piece that i love to use like underneath stuff and then on top of coat so you can see a little bit like the material it's a little bit see-through but it's so soft and so comfortable and so lightweight like there is something that i love about lightweight sweaters that you just don't feel bulky if you're layering so this is a great piece for that and i have it in white i used it a lot through the last year so i definitely wanted to get this one for this year and the gray one with the scarf this is a little bit more oversized i really love when the turtleneck is not like too restricting and um yeah 
I love the sweater. Lately, I really like gray on clothing, but yeah, super cute. And the scarf. So I got it and I fell in love with it. Like, it can be also like a blanket if you're traveling. And lately, I travel a lot by car and train. It's super soft and I think it goes with everything. And it's a great travel piece. Also for the house, like, I, th I think it's gonna be amazing. I took a quick break. I am ready. I changed to a blazer and I'm gonna go to do the live stream. So the live is gonna be like from 7 to 9 p.m. And after that, we're gonna go for dinner. I packed everything that I'm gonna need inside the Birkin 35. Again, great travel bag. I'm taking full advantage of that bag. I'm loving it. I don't think I'm walking. I'm just gonna take an Uber there. And tomorrow we have a free day. So sky's the limit. I'll make up some ideas of what to do tomorrow because since I've already seen all the touristic stuff, I can literally just sit down and smell the flowers. But there's a few things that I would like to do, like the idea of a musical or the theater. It sounds really, really nice. It's something that I would normally not do if Polo would come. She just doesn't enjoy them. Maybe a museum. So yeah, let's go to the live stream. I'm just gonna grab the bag and let's go. Honestly, I wish that the mirror that we have on the bedroom was not that small, but yeah. guys good morning it's the last day in london i have to go to the airport like at three i don't know what's up with my voice i think it was because of the live so the live stream ended at like at 10 so it was almost three hours and afterwards we went to have dinner to Monteca. i took an over and i died like i was so tired so i didn't vlog anything else but right now we're gonna have breakfast probably i'm gonna finish packing i cannot leave the hotel if everything is not like done i'm gonna ask if i can have a late checkout so i don't know i guess walking around i'm gonna decide what to do but let's go change i'm actually quite surprised how well my hair has been holding up on the trip like it's not that messy i am not sure if i want to go have breakfast at the same place than yesterday or if i should have breakfast here at the hotel i haven't really tried before the one that they have here so might be a little more practical and maybe later for my luggage at the desk and just go into stuff seems that we do have sunny day today again so that's good i'm wearing an oversized blazer the new pair of jeans the mini kelly and uh, Again, the ballerinas. So I want to check the Harry Potter hours and it starts at 2, so I don't think that I'm gonna be able to make it because I'm supposed to leave the hotel at 3 to the airport, so we're sitting at the park bench. I brought my Kindle to read a little bit, so walking around it is. to the hotel to check out i'm gonna leave the luggage at the front desk and just take the bags with me i think i want to go find a sushi place before we head to the airport i'm going to heathrow so i think there's a little bit of shopping that can be done another chance for me to look for the shoes so let's check out walk around again and then go to the airport and maybe we can try to do some shopping at the airport mm -hmm. 